Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you my eyeshadow palette collection. Over the past few years, I collect some eyeshadow palettes. And before I moved to Turkey, um, I gave all of my eyeshadow palettes to my sister. But since I live here, I collected a few more. So I thought, let's show you them. I always like to see these kind of videos. I don't know, I just like collection videos, I guess. But I also like to watch them to maybe put some palettes on my wish list. So um, yes, I really hope you guys will enjoy this video. And if you are new here on my channel, I'm a Dutch girl and I'm living in Marmaris, Turkey. And I make a lot of beauty related videos, lifestyle vlogs. If you like that, make sure you subscribe. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Saturday. And of course, you can also follow me on Instagram. And now let's get started with the video. Okay, so I'm starting off with the palettes that I have for the longest time. And that are my two naked palettes. I'm sure you heard of them and as you can see they are well used so the naked one i have for the longest time i think the colors are really nice in here although there are a lot of shimmers and not as much matte shades um but i think it's a really pretty palette and especially if you want to start with makeup um they're really wearable colors especially the first few right here they are just perfect for everyday use. It's such a classic, isn't it, the Naked palette. And then I also got the Naked 3. So I first got the 1 and after the 3. And this one has gorgeous, like, rosy tones. And I think it's so pretty. As you can see, you got a lot of pink shades right here. And also some darker shades right here. But I'm not using them as much as the lighter shades. Again, the same with the Naked 1. Not as much matte shades. I use these Naked naked palettes a lot in the past but I have to say I'm not grabbing for them as much anymore I guess I use my other palettes more but I have to say the colors are really pretty and again if you want to start with makeup or you like really soft um, natural tones I'm sure you will love these ones then also to other palettes from Morphe that I have for quite a while it is the 35F palette and this palette is one of my favorites and the 35T palette and to be honest I'm not using this one uh, that much but let's start with the 35F which is one of my favorites and I will show you why so this is the 35F palette and why I love this palette is because of the shades as you can see a lot of wearable shades I love the golden shades in here but also the bronzy ones and you also got some pink tones and why I love this palette is because these colors right here are all mattes so you got a lot of shimmers but also a lot of mattes which are all naturals and I think this is just a perfect palette for every day on my wedding day I used this one as well I did my own makeup and um, yes I think this is also perfect for parties or for a wedding so yes definitely one of my favorite palettes of all time and then like I said the 35 D, yeah the 35d i'm not using as much as you can see the colors are all quite uh, dark i bought this palette a few years ago because i was also doing other people's makeup like a makeup artist um, i went to beauty school so i purchased this one for that but to be honest um for myself i'm not using it that much you can create a lot of beautiful smoky eyes with it um, a lot of silvers also some greens which are really pretty and i love this golden shade right here so yeah it is a nice palette if you like a lot of smoky eyes or darker shades also a lot of purple so um if you like that this one is maybe perfect for you and again it's great because there are a lot of shimmers but also quite a lot of mattes so i think the morphe palettes are really great for the price and also the quality then moving on to these toned palettes and i have to say i think these are the cutest they smell amazing as well really sweet and they're squishy so i love them so i will quickly show you them all so the first one is the maple glazed one and they are from iheart revolution by the way this is the maple glazed one beautiful everyday colors then the next one is called chocolate dripped then we got strawberry sprinkles and then this blue one is called blueberry crush and then the last one is called a raspberry icing 
And this one has some beautiful pink shades. I made a video testing these ones out and I will link it somewhere up here or in the description box down below. I think for the price, they are really great quality. And again, you can travel with them, which I think is really great because they are quite small and compact. So yes, really cute little eyeshadow palettes. The next three palettes are again from uh, I Heart Revolution and I will again pop the videos where I tested these ones out in the description box. And these ones are my favorite at the moment. I use this one today on my eyes and I think the quality is amazing. I think it's even better or the same as the Naked palette. And it's just a lot cheaper than the Naked palette. For one Naked palette you pay like about 50 euros and these ones are about about 12 euros my sister got them in the sale but again i think for 12 euros you can't go wrong so the first one is called tasty advocado and it has beautiful green shades as you can see a lot of green shades although you can also create some natural looks because as you can see there are also some nice brown bronzy tones so um, if you like to experiment or you like green eyeshadow you can definitely give this one a go and then the next one like i said that i used today is called the tasty chili one and i think this packaging is just adorable this one is definitely more wearable uh, than the avocado one and i think the colors are beautiful i really love like the uh, yellow and orangey tones in here today i used the yellow one i used this vibrant pink one on my eyes and i also used fire and yeah i really love it so it's just a beautiful palette and then the last one which i think is my favorite is the tasty pizza one and these colors are beautiful for everyday wear as you can see the colors are beautiful and what i like about these palettes again is that you have also a lot of mattes and shimmers um, what I miss by the naked palettes but I really love the shimmery shades in here like the silver one is absolutely stunning and this one which is called marinara it's just unbelievable and when I wear the color marinara I always get a lot of compliments about my eyeshadow so yeah I think they are really beautiful and look at this palette this is called the essence let me see silver glitter show and the packaging is amazing look at that how beautiful is it? So this palette has a lot of shimmers. I got rid of the black because it broke, unfortunately. But um, yes, a lot of shimmers, just three mattes and this one was a black matte. But I think the quality is really nice for a essence uh, palette. Uh, the shimmers are really beautiful and I love like the golden shades. So again, a perfect palette for every day. And what I like most about this palette is the packaging. It's just really cute. So yeah, a nice palette to have in your collection. And I got eyeshadow all over my hands. I'm sorry for that. Then I got two left. And the first one is a Disney palette from Catrice. And look at this. It has Minnie on it. How adorable is that? Look how cute she is. And this is how it looks. It also got a nice mirror. And I think it's a really pretty palette. A lot of burgundy shades and a lot of mattes. You've got uh, five mattes and four shimmers, which is a nice change, I think. So this palette, some of these colors were really great and others were a little bit uh, less pigmented. You can again see it in my review video, but all, overall, I think it's a really nice palette. And then the last one is again from Essence and it's called the Crystal Dreams. And I think this is super cute. You've got some bronzy shades and also some pink tones. A lot of shimmers and again great for every day. And I think yeah it's a really cute little palette. And I think it's just a really nice palette to have in your collection. And um, you can create a lot of everyday looks with it. And you can apply two shades and you are done with your everyday look. So yeah a really nice palette again. And I'm covered in eyeshadow now which is great. <laughs> So I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing my eyeshadow collection. If you like to see a tutorial of one palette or you want to see like a look, um, yeah, let me know in the comments down below and I can film it for you guys. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Saturday. And of course, you can also follow me on Instagram. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye!